Uh, yeah, so now we got to find where he is. And down we go. Um, but I don't know. Maybe he's somewhere else in the building. I don't know. I found notes for a new screenplay in Harvey's room. Ten guesses what it's about. Us? Yeah, and the experiment. Tell me that's not suspicious. Was there a description of me? Did he mention my nose? <laughs> he said it was B, didn't he? Helena! I have a right to know. No, his notes were free of comments on your proboscis. Good. Am I the pretty one? It wasn't all that fleshed out yet. Darling, don't get all worked up. It's bad for your complexion. Right, okay, so we've done that. I'm still only in Edmund, which I should be very much aware of. But we've got 10 left, and we've still got 12 for setting a trap, and I don't know what else we can do, because I think we've kind of done everything. Unless I've missed stuff in here, which is entirely possible. So let's head back down here, because I think we've done everything? Maybe if I head back to the pool? No, I don't think there's anything else to do in the pool, is there? I think we've interacted with everyone as much as we can. That looks like a statue I saw in Copenhagen. Sort of. Ah, Little Mermaid. Hmm. I can't go to the gym, can I? We're going to be visualizing weightlifting tonight in this gym. I need to find a way to rig this place so I can catch this jerk red-handed. Oh, right. I can't come to the gym. No, 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 no. I want to rig the flash powder traps at the doors, but I'll need to assemble them first. Mr. Universe. There. These flash powder traps are ready to go. I don't really want to it put it down in the lobby, because what happens when... Brainiac you... reference books, no doubt. It's a mirror... So do I put them on here? <coughs> yeah, that'll work nicely. I'll set it up later after the gym closes for the night. Okay, that makes sense. Right. No, wrong button. So we got five and ten. I don't think there's anything else in here. Oh, there's a bench. Someone's been using that machine and didn't wipe it off. Ooh, kind of gross. Ew. Lights. I was sign. The gym closes at eleven. I'll get here before then and hide. When they lock up, I'll be inside. And locked in. Those lights are controlled by the switch plate near the door. So there. What did I do? Oops, what did I do? I don't know what I just did. I'm really confused. As we've done that, so we've just got to find this other plant. This is the thing about the plant stuff. What's it like? Pieces of gold. Go away. Stop it. Stop it. Ah. So there's nothing else in here to interact with, is there? Hmm. I think that's everything. If anyone enters this room tonight, the traps will alert me. I'll turn on the lights and snap off some pictures with Helena's camera. This should be very interesting. Oh, the switch plate, so the light's going to come on. I see. Dining hall I can't go to. Just doesn't exist. Um, having a look at the resident board. All the students in the experiment live in this residence hall, except for me, of course. I'm the token gypsy. All the students. All right, okay. So that's nothing new. Can I head out to the quad? But I don't think there's anything in the quad. 
Everyone looks so serious. I get that way during the full moon. Some people do the werewolf thing, but I do Walter Cronkite. Well, it feels momentous, doesn't it? We're agreed, right? We're going to vote. And we'll all either stay in the experiment or quit. Whatever the group vote decides. One for all and all for one. How do we do it? Should we just raise hands? Silent ballot? Do we need that? Does anyone care? What? What am I doing? What am I doing? Um. No, it's not the mailbag one. No, it's not the telephone one. Bottomless cup. Done that. No. Fruit bowl. Uh, you invite members of the audience to help you think up the names of different fruit. As they call out names, you write them down and put them in a bowl. Your fruit bowl. When you've got plenty of fruit in your fruit bowl, you show the audience a previously prepared gift bag. So that you predict ahead of time what fruit you plucked from your fruit bowl. Invite a volunteer to pull a name from your fruit bowl and read it. Show the contents of the gift bag. Voila, your prediction is revealed to be correct. You actually write down every time the name of the fruit you previously prepared. Call out names of fruit. Oh, that, no, I need to, need to actually say that. Although it would be like, oh, I need to do the preparation. Which actually makes sense. You do need to do preparation for it. You need a bowl. I have a suggestion. I know a great way to vote that's democratic, but allows for an element of fate. Plus, it assures that the vote can't be split. Do tell. I'll write down everyone's vote and we'll put them in a hat. Charles, can we borrow yours? We'll draw one ballot from the hat, and that will be the final decision. Interesting. Hmm. It's good. Chances will favor the more popular answer, but it still allows everyone a shot. <laughs> like drawing straws. Fate. It allows for fate. I like it. Good. Let's start. Charles, quit the experiment or stay. Quit. Helena? Not that it isn't a barrel of laughs, but quit. I vote quit too. I'm sensing a trend here. If everyone says I quit, stay. Yay! Stay. And now me. I vote stay. Good thing we were relying on fate. Who wants to pick? I'd like to. May I? Go on. Drum roll. We don't know what it could be. Are we going to quit? Who knows? Steve. That's it then. One for all. And all in deep doo doo. See you tonight. Bye, Sam. See you. See ya. Bye, Sam. Did you rig that, oh great Sam Eeny? It was a split vote. It could have gone either way. And I hope you know what you're doing. It's on to you. Are you all right? That expression. Showering again.
windows open. Someone can see me showering. Ah. I'm getting water all over the tiles. My reflection in a mirror. No. I'm really confused. What was that meant to show? Okay. Private lab. Day in the rowboat. Psy in mind. What happened the day before the experiment? Oh, uh, so this this is this is this is the thingy. This is the, this is the same day, I think. I was thinking I was looking at the jab, all right, balcony. The balcony that overlooks the back garden. I haven't used it since Laura left. Left? Well, she died. Or being stupidly euphemistic. Nothing in there now. Was Laura really here this morning? I don't know. I can almost picture Laura in that tub. She loved hot baths. Okay, so then it looks like there's anything else to interact with. Ooh, something else to interact with. Towel. I don't need a towel. Okay. Do you need anything over here? Those are mine. Uh, okay. It's ni nice to know that he's possessive and understands the concept of ownership. Ah, the dress. We probably don't want to interact with that, I don't think. To the lab? Maybe we can figure out what we're doing? Uh, maybe the kitchen. Good morning. How was your breakfast? Fine. Is Samantha in? She's at university. Would you like me to call her? Actually, I prefer not to be disturbed. If she comes in, tell her that, will you? Of course. Anything interesting on the notice board I should be aware of? It's a business card from Inspector Pazer of the Oxford Police Department. He was the investigator on the accident. Simon's business card with his phone number. Uh, I'll just go down to the private lab. We might find something we're doing there, which we might need to do some work with. I don't think... Oops, wrong button. Huh. Yes, I think we're only work, we only work here, don't we? Yes, so let's make our way in. Might work out what her my next experiment is. Oh, we were gonna do something with the picture, weren't we? We've forgotten that. It's a scanner. Wait. That wasn't impo, it was just it I am, wasn't it? What is it, Laura? Keep going, darling. Give me a few more letters. You sound anxious for this, so I had it couriered to you as we discussed on the phone. The only thing you need to do is connect an orange email. Oh, right. Since you have my book, I won't bore you with the details. Yeah, so we did that. So, like, each day we're getting a few more letters for that. That's, that's interesting. Computer. The picture is as good as it's going to get without. So, we need help. But I can't. Yes, we're not going to get any any work from that, are we? Hmm. So 
Let's head up to the... Let, can I go into my office? I, I honestly can't remember. Or is it just one of those things I don't like my office anymore for some reason? That's my old consulting office. There's nothing in there that I want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Really? Um... Maybe the main lab? Maybe. I bought that for the clinic. We never used it. Files? I'm no longer tripping over files, is it? At least that's been sorted out. Getting to the main lab? Oh, I'm doing a thing on the computer here. Booting on hard drive. Memory size 696150. Start, yeah. Loading fMRI interface, something, something. It would take hours to look through all the data. I need to zero in on a specific time. Right, so we need to work out when these things occurred. Because otherwise we've got a lot of time to work on. Can I look at my diary? Okay, yeah. Alright, so it's only like chapter 3 and 5, so neither of those are particularly important. That's unfortunate. Let's go back to the kitchen. Maybe she has an idea of what time it was. Hmm. Or maybe there's a newspaper. David, can I get you something? No, I'm fine. Hmm, newspaper? Newspaper. No. Some item giving us an idea of the date would be useful. Um, no. No, that those aren't relevant. Laura's paintings at Timmins Park. Laura's painting. No. Laura's. It's Timmins Park. The family china. System. Um, hmm. 